What's good, y'all? It's your boy Tego here, and this game right here was a another forty-four dollar game on BG. I mean, those of you that seen my last video I put out, you can see the stroke it continues once again. It continues losing on Hail Mary, dropping picks, just a bunch of fluke bullcrap. So I'm just laying back on the money games and everything from now on, cause there's no way I should be getting this mad at the game. I've really been getting cheated so much to the point like well it's not even funny like if someone was getting cheated as much as I am they would have been like <laughs> they broke their TV or some shit but that's that get into this game a little bit um I got the Seahawks my opponent got the Niners I mean I know you guys probably are tired of seeing his teams but when you're playing for money that's what everyone uses that's who everyone uses pretty much you know you don't want to pick a lower team unless you a chance you obviously want to pick a higher rated team to um you know boost your chance of winning for the most part but as you can see my first drive was just a complete bullcrap and just looked awful now my opponent came down the field fairly easy this game really turned out to be one of the best games i played this year that's why i labeled it game of the year um the reason when i put my videos game of the year it only game of like the year from everybody it means my game of the year like the best game i've played so if you guys are wondering that so right here we're running the rap gain about 40 yards rushing probably run it again try to see if my opponent can stop it or not we gain a nine right there run the ball marshawn pick up a first down marshawn lynch is really good in this game really really good right here nice little out route right man so we kind of redeeming ourselves a little bit Right there, he runs man. I do the unbumpable user catch. Simple. So right now, it's 7-6. Um, of course, I go for two. For those of you guys that are new to the channel, and I, I go for two every single time. Unless I don't have to. Unless I'm going up by 10 or whatever. But go for two. Don't get it. So I'm showing you guys this play right here. Right? I ran Fagby on this play. You're going to see later on in the game. But right here, I think it is. Is it right here? Yep. Picked him. So I ran Fagby the first time, and then the second time, I blitzed him, and he panicked and threw a pass. When he had B open to the right side of the field, once again, when you're playing the game, when you're watching the game, it's totally different. And what happens my two plays later? Throw a pick right back. So this is just complete bull crap. I want to talk about my ebook. Um, those of you that purchased it, I got great feedback. Um, I appreciate you guys for buying the ebook and giving me good feedback. Thank y'all. Um, defensive ebook doing well, offensive one doing very well. Um, but as you know, I got like about like almost like 20,000 views on that. Um, once again, I labeled that the best play in the game because I felt like that was the best play in the game at the time, and I still think it is. I haven't came across another simple play that's really that effective. So, those of you that haven't purchased it, you can go ahead and purchase it. I'll leave the link in the description as always. It's $15 from either ebook the offense or the defense and if you happen to buy two of them you get the offense and the defensive one for 15 I mean the offense and the defense for 25 total so basically like five dollars if you buy two so as you can see did you see that move he caught me with I look like a straight fool we come back another out route once again he's running man you're gonna run man I'm gonna abuse the man look at that I'm bumpable don't run a man on me we down to the goal line now now to his wood I had X wide open. Did you guys see X was wide open? I need to improve my reads a little bit, but surprisingly, every game I've played, I've had a perfect passer rating. A perfect passer rating, which I've thrown no picks. Or, well, this game I threw a pick, but I've had perfect games. Like, it's really been effective. I really like the offenses that I'm running. It's real simple. Make quick reads. Reads is the most important thing I said I want to prove on this year. Defense, um, I'm pretty still, I'm doing good on defense. I'm adjusting to people's tendencies, and that's pretty much the same. But offensive reads, you want, of course, you want to lessen the picks. You want to make smart reads, throw the ball out of bounds when you have to, and that's been very huge for me. So look at this, nice pocket present. He rushes four or five, stand in the pocket, throw a nice little pass across the middle of the field. So right now we down seven. Touchdown. Another out route. Running man. And keeping you from out route. But we down a touchdown. So here's where he had a chance to stop me. Third and seven, right? He's running faggy. All he has to do is, all he has to do is just watch the quarterback. He has a spot. He should just be using the quarterback. And, of course, he doesn't use it, the quarterback. He goes to um, 
guard the run rather than me running with the quarterback. He thought I was going to run inside. So he's running the ball a lot this game. Like, it's either like his tendencies are if he doesn't get, if he gets like five yards. Look at that youth pick right here. Beautiful. If he gets like five yards, he will run the ball again. But if he gets like two, he won't run the ball again. So, I mean, that's kind of a smart way to think of it. You get five, run it again. You get like two or three. I mean, you probably want to pass. Or you may run it again just to get a couple more yards. So, right here, we punch it in with um, Marshawn Lynch right after the interception. So, right now, it's 27-14, third quarter. And pause, 27-24, third quarter. Look at this. Kaepernick down the field. If Kaepernick would have just pushed me a little bit, he would have been gone. That was a great use by me to try to keep him, keep myself side by side in order for him to run. So, running back right here, he just takes off. Simple, nothing too special. Look at that. This guy got two pancake blocks. Who the fuck is that? Look at Vernon Davis, I think. Two straight pancake blocks. Like, he don't even care. So, you guys seen when he came out of snugs and did that curl earlier, right? He did a little curl to the left slot. That was kind of like bad user on my behalf. We're going to see right here how we just make the simple adjustment. Right there, that should have been a pick by me, but I don't know. We make the simple adjustment. We play man this time. He throws the quick curl, and Bobby Wagner with the interception. Like I said, guys, it's the simple things, the simple things that will stop your opponent. Like, you just see what the tendencies are and just adjust to it. Like, it's really... Not hard at a point. You know someone's doing an out route. Put your cornerback in a the flat. They may not react every time because this game zones is a little broken. But look at this user pick. Oh, man. So I stop him. I'm talking about my reads. I have X and B wide up on the out routes. So I stop him. And what happens? I throw a freaking pick. We're going to see later on in the game how I throw a nice little dot out of that same exact play. So right here, he does something very stupid. He has the first down. Pitches it back for no reason. My dude, Richard Sherman, picks it up. Try to get a little headbang going. Then at the end, I hit him with the cowboy. Shit. <laughs> so right now, we up 10. We feeling real good right now. We up 10. This offense is not high power, so we're not worried about getting stopped at all. Not worried about trying to stop him. But basically, this drive, he just hits me with bench, 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 bench. Every play. I don't know how my dude wasn't reacting to it. I don't know what was going on, but he hit me with bench. Every single play, so... Nice little drag. Bench with a drag. Simple. It was just fucking my zones up. Fucking my man up. They were just like, hey, we ain't gonna react. We're gonna do what we wanna do. Um, I don't know if you guys play Grand Theft Auto. It's a little off topic right here, but I will be getting Grand Theft Auto. And I'm I'm starting, I think I'm gonna start posting Grand Theft Auto um, on my channel. I mean, let me know what you guys think of that. I know this was a Madden channel, but Grand Theft Auto is a game that I really like. And I'm excited for that game to come out. The last Grand Theft Auto came out, what, four years ago when I was in middle school or some shit? And I'm in college now, I mean, came out a, it came out a minute ago. And that game was alright, but this game just takes, looks like it takes it to the next level. I can't wait till this game come out. Um, so, I think I'm going to be, well, I'm going to be putting out Grand Theft Auto a lot more often. That's right along with Madden. So, I mean, those of you that like Grand Theft Auto, look at the playmaker, what I was talking about. Tricked them that time. So, those of you that like Grand Theft Auto, I mean, stay tuned. New subscribers, um, feel free to subscribe because I will be posting Grand Theft Auto. That game is just too awesome. Look what happened right here. He drops a pick and the ball goes right into my hand. So, that's just fluke right there. That's something I can't. That's something that I rarely ever get. So, I had to show you guys that. He dropped the pick and the ball went right into my hand. So, hey, we'll take that. Look at this those bench once again and Richard Sherman don't react to it then my man Bruce Irvin gets injured so Bagley right here again I tried to use it that but I burned it around holding wild like a dummy rather than strafing I'm getting a little used to it I'm almost 100% I said about I'm a I'm about a 75% there right there dot wide open they just went dumb on me so right now all we gotta do is pretty much pick up a first down and we win the game so let's see what happens Let's see what happened to take away. Right there, we had a wide open, but of course we're gonna run to pick up the first down. And I tried to slide, but I went left, and when as I went left and pressed X, my quarterback did a stupid ass juke, and he just fumbled the ball. So he runs the read option, hands it up to the running back, no huddles, runs the read option again, but this time, look what happened. Gets all the way down to like the four yard line. 
Look at that, no stick none. So right now I'm like, well, that's game. I'll just pack it up. So we call a timeout and then we whiff on his stick. So right now he's up four points and I have about see how much time left? Twenty eight seconds left to get down the field and score a touchdown. So meanwhile you guys can see these plays I'm about to run. The situational plays. Like I said, you guys do not want to run your whole offense early in the game because when you get down to the wire like this, they know which plays you're gonna run, they know which route you're going to. So these set of plays I have not ran at all the whole game. These end routes and deep post routes. Nice little catch by rice. I have not ran these plays all game. So look at this. Nice dot. Middle of the field. Right here we throw a streak. Beat the press. Get down on the floor. And what happens right here? Tick top. Tick top. Die. I do Harper. Catch the ball. And we win this game, y'all. Yeah. We pull out the W, and I'm excited about this game because I thought I had the game lost because I messed up, and I ended up winning the game. So like I said, um, comment in the video below. Let me know what you guys think, what you guys want to see. Like my video if you guys enjoy it. Um, let me know if you guys are interested in the Grand Theft Auto. Let me know if you guys are getting Grand Theft Auto um, yourself. So right here, he dives down thinking it's NCAA, and unfortunately, the time runs out. So... I'm gonna let you guys check out the replays. Yeah, about check out the replays of these plays and see how I got down the field real easy and effective and how clutch it was, you know. But um, stay tuned. It's your boy Takeaway out. Peace.